Welcome back guys to Fog Football. It was no surrender today for Rangers as they failed to surrender to their Glasgow rivals. And that makes it, I believe, six old firm derbies now in a row, unbeaten. Seven. Seven. Unbeaten. Oh, the Rangers fan would know. I wouldn't. We've already did the uh, the match review. Now it's time to rate these players. So let's get stuck into it. We're going to rate the starting 11. We're going to rate the subs. We're going to rate the managers. And then we're going to find out what the overall average rating of our teams are then. So with that said, guys, let's rate the Rangers Celtic players. Right, here we go then, guys. We're going to start with the goalkeepers. And in next, we'll, we'll, go with the, we'll go with the home team, then we'll move to the away team. So up first, McCrory. I thought, even though he didn't have that much to do, I thought that he, what he had to do, he did well. He kept a clean sheet at home in an old firm derby, and he's the third choice goalkeeper. I don't think you could have asked for much more of the guy. I'll give I'm him giving him a seven, or an eight. Uh, All right, okay. Well, we'll we'll start off with McCrory then. I feel like nah, I give him an eight. Seven point five then for McCrory. That is what it is. As for let's move over to the other goalkeeper then for Joe Hart. Uh, again, a guy that I didn't feel had that much to do. He had a couple of shots to deal with. Kent's shots were pretty poor in this game. Uh, just easy enough saves. And the one time that Celtic needed Joe Hart the most, also his passing from the back was woeful today. A lot of his passing was poor. A couple of, He tried a couple of long passes because Celtic do like to play it from the back. And a couple of passes he hit straight into the crowd. Unless he was aiming for Rangers fans then. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, for me, though, the goal should have done a lot better. Gets a hand to it. Doesn't do enough to keep it out. I'm going to I'm gonna go ahead and give Hart a four. It might seem a bit I harsh. I agree with a four. four. I was going to say four, so... I'm giving him a four because I just think he should have done, he should have done better, so, you know... Why is it four? That's what it is. Joe Hart's four is hanging to the right there. If he was more to the right, he'd have saved Hollander's header, but that's a totally different story. Right! Speaking of fours, we're moving on to Barisic, and I'm going to give him the exact same rating. I think Barisic's form has been pretty poor for a while That's today. That's not spelled Barisic. No, we ain't going to worry about it, are we? There's, a, there's an I in there, or the A is. Um, I'll give Barisic... He got the assist. Uh, I'll give him a... I can't give half ratings, can I not? No. I'll give him a... I'll give him a five. I'm giving him a four, so there we go. Four, nice wee 4.5 there for Barisic. I just think the guy's been poor for a while. Speaking of someone who's poor, Starfelt... Again, just doesn't look comfortable. Uh, he doesn't look like a four million pound player. Now you can say four million pound players are shape, but when the old firm spend four million pounds, we're going to do the home team, then go to the away. No, team. we're doing in, in, in player tell, relative position. Ah, well, then you fucked it up then, because Starfield isn't a left back. Yeah, but uh, fine, we'll go with Uranovic, man. See the way this, this see the way this guy gets. No, I don't give a fuck. Just... No, we'll go. No, we'll go with Uranovic. There you go. Boom. Has to always fucking make a deal. You know what I mean? It's supposed to be a quick two minute pitch video, and he, he wants to drag out to. 20 20 minutes, which I have no problem with. Oh, I I'm do uh, made his debut, had a shot about five minutes for time. I don't think he should be shooting for there because he's never going to score, but he actually got pretty close. And if that went in, he probably gets mad of the match for that goal alone. Uh, I don't think the guy, I don't think he was bad, but to me, he didn't stand out. He didn't really do anything. I'm going to have to give him a. And then he, gave, well, it wasn't, it wasn't his fault. He didn't really. I'll give him a five. Um, yeah, I'll give him a five. If we, I'd probably give him a five point five. If we do half ratings, but we don't. Uh, I thought he linked Fucking up. mad that you're rating this guy higher than Barisic, though. That's all I'm going to say. I Barisic thought, actually got the assist. I thought Barisic was poor. If you didn't like it, right, then, you know. Off. Right, next uh, up, Hollander. Uh, Hollander, for me, I got the goal. I'll give him he, a he 7. He kept a clean sheet. I'll give him a 7. He, yeah, I'll give him a 7. I don't, I don't think he was that great, to be fair, apart right. from the goal. Welsh. No, we'll do Starfelt. Starfelt. I see from now on, we'll just date fucking across and cross. See this uh, fucking zigzag pitch. Starfelt, just to me, should, should have done a lot better with the goal. Wasn't marking hand or well enough. I'll give him a two. I thought, I thought he was fucking shit. A two, I think, is extremely harsh. I, I'd give him a, I'd give him a four. So I, that rounds up to a three. Yep. Big three there for Starfelt. Old soon. Um, I'll give him a six. I feel like. He helped out Balogun a couple of times, but again, I felt yeah, he almost he, he, let, he let Edward through there when he took that touch, Edward, and she probably should have did better with that opportunity. I thought goals and yeah, not the greatest game for him, but he kept the clean sheet. He was on the winning side. I think a bit of six is probably as low as you can give him. Welsh. Uh, Welsh. Thought he did all right. He was, he's the main centre back at the moment until Celtic can get someone else I'll in. Give him a five. I think a five's probably fair. I mean, uh, Ralston. Um, he's been his form's been good as, as of like, he did he did some good link up he did I'll give out, him a five out, out, out in the right but yeah but he was 
you know, he thought he could have been better. Well, yeah. I'll give Ralston a five. Right, next and for stop, the, the makeshift, I'm right giving him back, a nine. I was, wow. I was going to give him a ten, but I feel like tens are special and should be reserved for you know one of a kind stuff. It was great, but I'll give him a nine. Right, I'm giving him an eight. What? Right. An eight? He was fucking. Well, he's man. I think he's man of the match, but I'm giving him an eight. He single handedly dealt with the best player in the league at the minute. Well, when you put it like that, yeah, you're right. Actually, I'm going to give him a nine as well. I thought Balogun was fantastic today. Uh, playing out of position against the informed player in the league, I thought this guy was going to struggle, but he didn't. And no. you have to, I don't think, I don't think Tavernier or Patterson could have done as good a job as he did today. So I think a nine overall is pretty fair for him, right? Moving on to the midfield, then we've got Kamara. I will give Kamara. For me, I'm, again, I'm a six. I'll I, give him a six. I don't think he was bad, but again, I just don't think he really six. done anything. Uh, Cal McGregor. <sighs> I'll give him a six. I felt like he's I, I, I thought the best at the Celtic midfield. Yeah, I, am. I again, I agree with that. Hey, a guy that got a shitload of plaudits today. Apparently, he ran the show. I just didn't see it. He he did the degree in the second half, but I felt like he was giving away the ball quite a few times. Yeah, for me, it's a for me, it's a five for Davis. I'll give him a six because he did improve in the second 5. half. Five point five. Oh well. Right, even me, the Turnbull, Turnbull, I'm giving. I'm giving a. a fr- I'm giving a two. I feel like he was the worst. I'm fucking giving. Half. I'm going to give a three. So that's a 2.5. Every time he got the ball, I felt like he gave possession away. Every set away. piece was pish. Yeah, there was a set piece for Celtic had, like they were trailing not long to go, and he played one of the worst fucking crossings into the box you'll ever see. I don't know if it was a cross or a shot, but whatever it was, it was shite, and you wouldn't want it next to your name. And what Turnbull's getting next to his name is a 2.5, and I thought today he was pretty poor. Uh, moving on to Arrivo, I thought, hey, yeah, I thought Arrivo was pretty good today again. I'll give him a 7. I'm actually impressed with Arrivo. Uh, when he first joined the club, I didn't think he was that great, but I think it's over the past year he's been, you know, I think he's been one of Rangers' better players. I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm not giving him a seven. I'll give him a six, six point five overall. I mean, I thought he was all right, like, but again, I don't think he was fantastic or by any means. Uh, Christie thought I'll give not his greatest I'll give game. Him a four. I'm going to give him a five, so it's a four point five. Thought, thought he was quiet, didn't do much today. Uh, right, Ken, Ryan right, Kent. I'm going to give Kent a three. I thought he was fucking shot. Yeah. Nah. I can't really argue Honestly. with that. Every going away, he was you know what? At, at least he's always a threat. He's always he's always a nuisance, but it wasn't that good. Like Waste, wasteful really in good. possession, just just not good enough to Kent today. I am also going to give him a free. I mean, he had he hit one of the tamest shots I think I've ever seen at Joe Hart, and <laughs> Joe Hart dived to make the save when he could have he literally could have caught over and fucking stuck his pink out and caught it with that. So yeah, free for me. Abada. This guy, I thought he did did nothing. nothing. I thought I'm going to give nothing. him. I'm going to give him a two. Fuck it. Uh, he actually did. No-, no, I mean he did nothing. Like I'm giving him a three. He was badder. No, I just no. take take away the two A's. Nice. Well, two A's at the end each. They at the end. They at the start. Boom. Aye. Bad. He's in a nice sandwich. Just like this fucking video, he was bad. Um, but yeah. So overall, two point five then. Okay, I, I think there's a difference between being bad and just doing fuck all. Right? And today he done fuck all. Uh, Roof. I'll give Roof a five. Uh, yeah, I thought he was quiet. Can't give him much more than a five. Just didn't really. Didn't stand out. Didn't do much. For a Hashi, I will give. A uh, first half, I mean, he, he did get through. He, I mean, he, he should have an assist. He, he laid it on a plate to Edward, and Edward couldn't finish. But. I mean, what I would say about Furuhashi is he was getting double marked as well. I feel, I feel like they're all I'll over him. I'll give him a six. I feel like he was getting uh, yeah, abuse for the Rangers like fans as well. Best player. Was it was it racist abuse? Who knows? Um, Celtic's best player probably was. He could have had three chances as soon as he got put in the middle by Angie. He started, you know, creating all these chances with runs. But again, he didn't. He didn't score and he didn't get an assist. I'll give him. I'll get, I'm happy with a six. But I mean, yeah, he was Celtic's one of Celtic's best players today, but. I don't know, there's something not right by giving him a 6 and you've got Ruth and Morelos who are going to get lower than him, but yeah, I'll give Morelos a 5. What's, what's, what's not right about it? You, so it's just because Rangers won, every one of the players to get a higher rate than himself? No, I'm not saying that, I just feel like he was pretty ineffective for like 75 minutes. Was Morelos and Ruth effective? Oh, you're right, Bergman. Were they? Oh, I'm just fucking, I'm just giving you my opinion here and you're fucking green. Who's the one doing the ratings? Right, I'll give Morelos a 5. I'll give him a 5 as well, I don't think he was that great today. I don't. No. And Edward, I'm giving a... I'm giving a two. Fuck it, that miss alone, man. I'll give him a three. All right. And I'm being, I'm being, I'm being generous. I feel like I'm, I feel like we're being generous with the three because, again, yeah, that miss. I thought he started. I thought Celtic started really well first 15 minutes and he looked positive, he looked lively. It's so the best I've seen Edward look, actually. He wasn't, right, didn't the look subs, good. I'm going to give Lundstrom and Arfield a five and I'll give Sakala a four. I feel like he just didn't 
not on long enough. Aye, and I feel like Sakala just... Oh, okay. He didn't do anything. Rogic. Oh, I agree with those ratings, by the way, for anyone just wondering why I put them in there. Um, Rogic, Montgomery. So I thought... I'll give Rogic Montgomery both fives, and I thought I'll give Soro a three. I thought he was fucking atrocious. Constantly gave away the ball once he came on. Yeah, and I thought Rogic looked all right when he came on, but he just did not do enough to. He oh. didn't have enough time to you know, make more of an impact. I don't know who Montgomery is, but the point still stands. <laughs> five. Soro, again, I think four. four. I'll give him a 3.5. Right. Uh, McAllister st- stood in for uh, Gerard today. Rangers came out a lot better in the second half. Didn't start that was, well. Was that him or was that Gerard? Who knows? Well, we don't know. Was Gerard there for a satellite? We don't know. I'm going to go ahead and give McAllister a seven. I think. I'll give him a seven. A seven. And for Ange Postelnoglu, I'm going to give firm. first old firm. His, I think his arse collapsed here. I started. I mean, start. I'm not, it's not his fault, fucking Edward. Well, I'm sorry, right? You need a goal in an old I firm, and he's not bringing I'm on a jet. I'm, I'm he's not bringing on yeah. a striker. What? M- Montgomery's a centre back. Exactly. Uh, see any bro- I'm going to give you a I'm, free Ange. Well, I'm going to get him. I'm going to him a four. So I like your wee, uh, your wee monologue and uh, promo package, but that doesn't really get get stuff in my book. All right, so three point five for Ange. Right now, this total thing we're supposed to give you the total rating, but fuck, I can't be asked there. Uh, <laughs> Average that out. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll just do an overall. For overall, for Rangers, I, I would give them, I, on that performance, I think a 7. Yes, right? I'll give a 7. A yeah. 7. And for Celtic... I'll uh, give a 5. Uh, uh, that's exactly what I was going to give. So there you go, guys. There's your fucking total scores. Read them right there. Player of the match. Uh, my Balogun with the 9. We'll, we'll make that... I'm just telling you now, though. We'll make that red. See Celtic's average score, it would never be a fucking 5. We'll make that a wee red there, because he was the man of the match. So there you go. If you, want, if you like this video, if you enjoyed this, and you want to see more player ratings like this, then let us know in the comments down below. And Fog Football will provide it. But anyway, it was Rangers that provided the W today in the first Old Firm game of the season. Now we're off for an international break. We'll be back after that. Some big games coming up. Get some fun with Scotland. Yeah, some fun. It'll be some fun or some pain. I'll be pain. You'll get all the, Here Scot- comes the pain. All the Scottish reviews and player ratings on this channel until in the next couple of weeks. Fuck off, right, Ivan. Until then. Until then, guys. It's been uh, Fog Football Aye. here. Peace. Aye. Let's go. Let's go, champ.